Hi, welcome to Camp Chats, part of our virtual Camp Fair Week. I am Hillary Bird, the managing editor here, and we are so excited today to talk with Gay Bruner from the American Camp Association. Welcome, Gay. Thank you for having me. Today, we are going to sort of explore how camp can help kids become more independent. Um, so what, uh, how does camp really help kids break out of their comfort zones and become a lot more independent than maybe they would be in school? Camp experiences really provide kids with valuable time away from technology. Near peer role models like camp counselors who can model health behaviors and healthy decision making. Uh -huh. um, we really like to call camp counselors the original influencer. <laughs> love that. I love that. <laughs> yeah. Kids get to try new things and get out of their comfort zone. Uh, and maybe that's the climbing wall or a talent show or throwing pottery, you know, for the first time. Um, they really get to build confidence, independence, and learn to try new things in a safe and supportive environment. Mm -hmm. uh, because we really do believe in those helmets and life jackets at camp. <laughs> That's, that's really awesome. What, you know, th there are a lot of skills like, you know, like swimming and, you know, and you said like throwing pottery and trying climbing walls and stuff like that. Um, what, what kinds of skills do kids learn at camp that they can start to use and, and grow um, as they grow as adults, even if it's not, you know, even if they don't continue climbing or, you know, that's the only time they ever throw pottery. What are those other like little softer skills that they can learn at camp that helps them grow that independence as they become adults? Well, I think one of the things that kids um, make friends and connect with other people from different neighborhoods, faiths, races, and uh, socioeconomic backgrounds at camp. Mm -hmm. um, and former campers have told us that through these experiences, that's helped them learn how to work in teams of diverse students in college um, and diverse coworkers early in their careers. Um, and we have um, at ACA decades now of research proving that these skills learned at camp support academic performance as well as the core of college and career readiness. Mm -hmm. So even if you come from a smaller town, you're meeting people from a bigger town or even vice versa, um, you know, that you wouldn't necessarily be exposed to at school. I, I, I sort of, I love that idea of that skill set of, of bonding and building with people um, that you don't know and wouldn't know and wouldn't maybe have um, exposure to um, within your own school, within your own town, even within your own neighborhood. Um, that's that's fun, and that's going to be really that's going to be really interesting and exciting. Especially, I mean, I was a I was a small town kid, and um, you know, when we went to Girl Scout camp, you you would meet a lot of people from bigger cities and um, and from significantly bigger towns, and they were like, "Hey, did you know where so and so is?" And it's like, I have no idea. <laughs> um, but <laughs> but you but you learn, and learning their experiences is is so much fun. Um, how uh, when you look at an average school day. Um, what, uh, what kinds of things does, does camp do um, that, that helps kids gain independence that they wouldn't get, you know, um, in their average school day? That tends to be really structured. Camp is structured too, but, um, you know, how, how does that help kids gain independence even within, within that structure and, you know, that they wouldn't get in their average school day? Well, I think um, one of the perks of camp is for kids to have an opportunity to learn outside of nature. Mm -hmm. and play in structured and unstructured environments. School's pretty structured. It's pretty rigid. Uh, you have sort of this routine that you follow. Um, and really um, being in these structured and unstructured environments really builds on physical development, agility, coordination, balance, strength, endurance, and overall strong bodies. I think parents uh, maybe want to see proof that time spent outdoors playing and being active has health benefits for their children. Mm -hmm. And there's really emerging data that shows time spent outdoors with other kids is stress reducing. And after a challenging year that we've all had, 
our kids could use some positive happy experiences to um, support their overall mental health. Right. Uh, big challenge this year for adults and kids. Um, and then setting them up to thrive this fall in school when they're back in the classroom. Um, and after a long and challenging and you know sometimes isolating year for kids, uh, the summer should really be a way to get away from technology uh, whenever possible for a really solid dose of sunshine. Oh my goodness, yes. Well, Gay, thank you so, so much for all of your help um, in, in explaining and, and describing what the benefit of giving kids that independence that they get at camp that they're not necessarily gonna get uh, sitting home. So thank you so much. My pleasure.